Mavis and Boko oversaw most of the operations while the engines were away in the big city. The other engines liked Mavis and Boko and found working with them a pleasure. But there were some that did not like being told what to do by diesels. said Jinty to Pug one morning as they shunted in the yard. The two engines had been borrowed from another railway and felt the whole situation was very unfair. Jinty said. For the rest of the week, Jinty and Pug flounced about only doing a quarter of the work they were given. The yard was so busy that Mavis and Boko didn't discover a Jinty and Pug's mistakes, and as time went on, it became very difficult to what, sort out what should go where. Soon, the yard was in such disarray that an inspector was called to bring order to the chaos. Said Mavis's driver. This made Mavis and Boko very nervous. <laughs> 